Hello everybody, we are here at, we're in downtown Kingsport, well not really downtown, we're um, walking in this place called, I think it's called the Indian Trailhead. Those are cool. Oh, those are cool. Look at all these cattails, you guys. So this is the place we're at. We're on this boardwalk thing. Look, those leaves are already turning red. That's tall. Um, it's about 8.30 at night. And we figured we would come down here. We we just went and got some wings at Wingstop, and we are going to do. I found these questions on Google. Um, I found them on Google for like mother daughters, but some of them they seem like they were for um, an older daughter, <laughs> like a, a grown up daughter I'm asking her mother. I'm a priest. And since she's only 11, uh, almost 12, I'm not. I cut most of them out. So we got 15 questions. So go ahead, oh. ask the first one. Mine? Yep, they're for uh, you to ask me. Are you proud of me? Yes, I'm very proud of you. You are de you are talented, you're beautiful, you're funny, you're smart, you're kind, you're caring. If anything, if, if I make a noise that sounds like I'm hurt, you're the first one in there to say, ask if I'm okay. Of course I'm proud of you. Um, was I a mistake? No, you were planned. I tried to have, get pregnant with you. My dad told me, uh, it was what you said, let's have another, another baby so we can try and fix this marriage. Well, no, it wasn't about fixing our marriage. It was um, because Aiden was not Travis's. You're not, he was not your dad's. I felt guilty because the whole pregnancy, we thought Aiden was his. Wait, was it, what, am I the only one that came from my dad and you? Yep. Huh. Yeah, and so... After Aiden was born, I felt really guilty that me and your dad didn't have a baby together because me and your dad, the way I got pregnant with Aiden is because me and your dad split up and I went back to Alaska thinking I was never going to see your dad again. And then I got pregnant with Aiden and I didn't know I was pregnant when I came down. And so that's how that happened. Uh, do you still love my dad? I have love for your dad. Um, I do have love for him because he's a good man and he's a good father, but I, I'm not in love with him, so it's different. Did you ever do drugs? Yes, I've done drugs and I still smoke weed, so I mean, yeah. I don't think that's really a drug though. Yeah. Um, Let's walk back this way because the lighting. Uh, do you ever think about your past? Yes, I do, um, but I use it for a reminder of what not to do and how to raise you good. Uh, do you judge? Uh, do you judge me for my choices? Nope. No, no judgment at all. Uh, did I turn out the way you wanted? You turned out better than I thought. Actually, I didn't really have expectations of how you would turn out. I kind of just let you figure out who you were by yourself. Um, when you were really tiny, yes, I put dresses on you because they were really cute, and I braided your hair and all that stuff. I but did have a dress. Yeah, you had a dress phase when you were about 11, but, you know. 11? Well, not 11, when you were about 8. <laughs> um, but no, I don't. Um. Uh, do you have any regrets? Nope, I don't have regrets. I don't let myself. There's no regrets in my life. If there's something I want to fix or do different, then I fix it and do it different. Um, what would you want me to do different? Um, clean your room more. <laughs> I know that. Uh, do something the first time I ask you. That's about it. Yeah. Uh, are you happy? Um, yeah, I'm happy for the most part. That is noisy. Ducks, they're, go, they're uh, camping in for bedtime. <laughs> uh, do you have a favorite out of any of us? Nope, no favorites. Did you really want a daughter? Yes, I did. I know my dad. I've always wanted a daughter. Uh, did you really? No, wait, no. Uh, one thing you wish you did different. One thing I wish I did different. Mm -hmm. Nothing really. Ooh, there's nothing really I wish I did differently. I, I think I've, I like my life at this point. Uh, do you think I'm beautiful? Yes, I think you're the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Uh, would you be my friend if we were the same age? Yes, I would because I was exactly like you. <laughs> we're still, we're basically friends and 
yeah we are friends but then there's a point when mother and daughter come in and I have to be a mother and not your friend yeah. and that's not always fun for me but it's necessary that was the last question that's the last question on that, on that side. and that's it the other questions were what would I do with Mark uh, so that was our question tag uh, I hope you guys like that we're gonna continue to walk and we'll show you some it's getting dark but we can still show you so this is so that building over there is the PetSmart it's kind of like a, sh a different shopping center place it has a uh, PetSmart and Ross and all that kind of stuff over there um, but that noise you guys hear those are cicadas and actually this year has been they have I thought that was a guy at first, didn't you? <laughs> oh my God. Um, Beautiful. But yeah, this place, the cicadas this year have been kind of strange and uh, quiet. They've not been as active as they usually are. Down here, there's some ducks. Um, there's always ducks down this way. It's really dark right here, so that's why the coloring looks all weird. But here you can see the creek. Um, I think this is called Reedy Creek or the Holston River. I don't really know. But here you can see the ducks. There's always ducks down here. This trail that we're walking on goes all the way to the other side of Kingsport. You can walk this trail to the other side. I've never done that. But, oh no, that little, that bird over there looks hurt. With the white. I uploaded a new YouTube video. Did you? Yeah. Look at that goose. Hello, goose. He's like, no, son. He's like, nah. Hello, Canadian geese. I don't want to get bit. Aren't you supposed to be in Canada? Yeah, really. Why well, aren't you in Canada, sirs? Are the white ones ladies? Um, I'm not sure. I think um, swans, the they all look the same, and then the Canadian geese are the same. So today, well last night I stayed up till about 5 in the morning. Same. And I was outside clipping my wisteria bush for about an hour. My neighbors probably think I'm some kind of crackhead or something. Because <laughs> I'm always outside at weird times in the night. But I do it at night because it's so hot during the day that it's almost impossible to stay out there and do anything. It is. And so I went to sleep at 5. And dude, I slept until... Get on the side, sis. Biker. I slept until literally 2.30 in the afternoon. I have not done that in so long. I don't remember the last time I slept till 2.30. Funny thing is, I stayed up until 5 same, like, same time. And then I, I woke up at like 1. Really? Yeah. Look at these pretty flowers, you guys. These, um, my app said they were cone flowers, but they don't look like echinacea I've ever seen. They're really pretty. Let's walk back the other way. It's getting dark out. See, there's PetSmart. Mm -hmm. And this over here is like more stores. Ice creams and nails and all Yep. And those cicadas are really loud. It's really nice out here. I haven't come on a walk in a long time. And I did find a couple feathers. Um, was hoping to find more, but it seems like they're all a bunch of little tiny ones. And I, man, it's loud. <laughs> Are you dancing to the cicadas? No, I'm just doing gentle pose because it's an anime show. But yeah, we got Wingstop. And I don't know if you guys have ever tried Wingstop, but man, those... I love the ones. I love those. She got the what, garlic parmesan wings. Yeah. And I got the spicy Korean. But they're fries, you guys. The fries are the best fries I've ever tried in my life. Oh, Mom. Huh? I know how to put my channel description in, uh, in, my, in the description. Then you upload on YouTube first, and then I then go on your account on the computer, and then go to my account on a different tab, copy the link, and paste in the description. Uh -oh. I'm going to go down there and get one of those big white flowers, <laughs> or feathers. Let <laughs> me hold it. Oh, here's one. Okay, I'm going to go down here. Excuse me, little duck. Look at this duck. I don't know what kind of ducks these are, but they're beautiful. Looky there. A nice, beautiful pure white feather. Look, there's one more right there. I'm gonna go swim soon. Excuse me, Mr. Duck. 
He's like, oh, excuse, excuse me. You. Don't mind me. Ex I, I excuse white, me. The white one and the brown one right here. Those are my favorite. Well, you don't have to make noises. I'm not going to touch you. He's all. <laughs> he was kind of getting ready to hiss at me. Like, He's all. <laughs> Look at, look at that black duck. Look at that black duck, you guys. Oh my god, look at him, Allison. That is a punk rock duck. Look, their, their boyfriend and girlfriend. Remember when we were going to read that story about those two ducks we saw? Them? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. Excuse us, ducks. Excuse us. Look, there's a gray one. Oh, look at that gray one, you guys. He's beautiful. It's okay. Oh, look, there's another black one. It's okay, duckies. We're just walking by. Don't mind us. I like this mind. Oh, good. <laughs> look at all the duckies going to sleep. I love so how they cute. sleep. It's so cute. I mean, shoes, because there's like little bumps I have to wear down. Uh huh. Okay guys, we are going to drive back home and settle in and I'll probably eat the rest of those wings when we get home because they smell delicious. I'll probably eat them in the morning or maybe tonight. In the of tonight. <laughs> well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and our little questionnaire and we will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.